guys forced a lot of turnovers for the second game in a row tonight. You didn't go with them. 36 points off the turnovers. Was it more because a lot of them were in the backcourt and just leading to kind of more breakaway situations, you think? Uh, well, yeah, for sure. But it was, it was uh, our emphasis uh, to, to uh, put more pressure on them, uh, to press and uh, try to get steals. So that was our, our game plan for, the, for this game. And, um, you know, we did a great job with it. Guys give it 100%. Uh, it was a great effort. Everybody was diving on the floor, and we got a lot of ball like that. And uh, we just went down and we hit it. So it, it, was, it was part of the game plan today. What was practice like the last couple of days? Intense. I mean, you know, we don't like to lose. And we want to do everything in our power to change and correct mistakes that we made in the first game. And, um, today, you know, we show that we can play defense at a high level. You know, we just got to keep this up, and this is the standard now, so we got to keep this, keep this going. You guys had over half your points in transition today, or off turnovers. Do you think that the offense can have, in the half court is a little bit disjointed, and if so, why? I wouldn't say it's disjointed. Uh, I think it's a lot of new guys on the team and we still learn uh, how to play with each other. We're getting better at it. But um, uh, it's it's all the all the mistakes we make offensive in the half court, it's all controlling stuff. It's all that we can fix and we can learn from. So we're we're gonna get back we're gonna work on it, we're gonna get better at it. But as time goes goes by, we feel gonna be better and better in that in that uh, area too. First guy had sixteen deflections, one off the high he's ever had for a player. The one that stood out to me was looked like he was diving near the broadcaster's table for that save that you know got a pocket for you guys. What did you guys see with his effort and being kind of a man defensively? He's tough on defense. I mean our model is toughness. And um, you know he just showed that and displayed it today, you know, harassing ours basically that's that's what he did today. Um, you know it's a lot of things that you know coach wants to see don't always show up on the stat sheet. And um, it's just hard on us. Can you just talk about your energy tonight and your kind of your mentality for basically your first start this season? Uh, yeah, I mean, uh, I, I didn't know I was going to start uh, before the game, uh, but I mean, it's it's the same mentality as every game. Try to give your best best effort. Uh, try to help the team win the game. Nothing really changed. Uh, whatever opportunity I get, I try to help my teammates out when I'm out there, and that's that's what it is. Just going back to Sky for a second, um, you know, he's a highly publicized player before coming to UCLA, just in high school a lot and last two stops, especially for his offense. Did you guys have an impression of how he was as a defender before this as well? Uh, yeah, I mean, I've known Sky for a long time and I, I know he can play both sides of the ball. I mean, college, you know, guys are asking you. Uh, so just defense is one of the things. He got quick feet, you know, he's very active with his hands and he just showed, showed you guys today. I mean, we've seen it before. Um, but he's just, you know, he went out there and played hard defensively, and things going to turn in his favor offensively. I mean, defense needs offense. That's, that's what we do here. Did a poor job of reporting. Got to ask Coach, how many total deflections do you guys happen to know? Did he write on the board or tell you? It was like 59. I think it was 59. Oh, yeah. 59, 60, something. Yeah, it was, it was, high it was very, very high. Number. So it was high, season high, it sounds like? I think it was. Yeah. Years so far, yeah. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank you guys. Good night. Appreciate you. Thanks, guys.